Hello there from Tasha'sTouch.com and TheAngels.us. Let me see if I can move you a little closer. It's kind of gravelly, but I think that will do. So, I got a request for a mother that wants to be with her spiritual daughter like I have spiritual children and the grandmother is making it kind of challenging for that to happen so I already I'm gonna start burning this I already did a portion where am I here I am of my ritual by placing my picture of them on their altar with intention underneath the candle of sorry gotta open up my book of shadows here while this is catching on <sighs> goodness gracious why didn't I put a thing there so I could there let me put the top of my cauldron there of uh, St. Patrick's candle and <gasps> oh shit <laughs> I cannot believe I just dropped it where'd it go well see ladies and gentlemen and this is why you do your work outside <laughs> Oh, there it is. Ay, ay, ay. In the... Under the sun, moon, and stars. So, that when these things happen, nothing burns down. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I just did that. Wow. And it's almost hot enough. So, we'll just keep on burning that. Tighter. So I did part of the ritual and you know I believe in a lot of different things because I think that all types of spiritualism work. Let's see, is that hot enough? Yeah, that's hot enough. So I'm just going to put that down there in my cauldron. And oh, I didn't bring my bells. Sorry, I'm still unpacking things, but you know me, as soon as somebody says, would you, I get on it. So, as you can see, I am in my, I'm in my Lady Narcissa attire. Yep, I'm in goddess mode. Okay. And we're going to just get this started. It's going to be very brief. As soon as I set the camera back down so you can see a little bit. Okay, there you go. <clears throat> so, if I had my bell, I would be chiming my bell three times. Okay. I would chime my bell three times, and I would be starting to add my sage to cleanse my space. some incense down in there. I was wondering what smelled so good. No, nope, you stay right there. We'll burn you too. We'll just burn everything.
Yes, we will. Yep, got my big fat crystals out and everything. So, I'm going to put my piece of sage on there. Cleanse my spiritual zone. Got my salt ready. So for the first part, you know, you always take your cleansing bath or shower. I took a shower with some um, parsley water. Look that up. I can't tell you everything. You got to look some things up for yourself, okay? And you got to learn, okay? So now, I'm oh, so sorry. I say, so I take my shower and I said my um, chants and prayers. I set up a picture of the mom, a picture of the daughter on the opposite side. Um, St. Patrick candle in the middle. Okay, now don't forget, this is why a lot of the the voodoo, hoodoo, santria, paolo, a lot of the other spiritualisms don't tell their secrets. So they will work for themselves. You see, everything can be written down for you. You have to figure it out for yourself. So I figured out some of it for myself and then I asked for a little bit of Ryan's help to help me think of things that I haven't thought of before okay but I did most of it more than half of it with myself okay and then I will leave that part of the grid up until the full moon and then I will get rid of it and speak of it no more so this part may the powers of the one source of all creation all perspective omnipotent eternal may the goddess the lady of the moon and the god horned hunter of the sun may their powers of spirit and stones rulers of the eternal realm any powers of the stars above and the earth below bless this place and this time and i who am with you I turn to the east and I say my prayer calling on the guardians hail guardians of the east and I do that individually so I'm going to do that later off camera because like I said this is going to be a quickie she needs this done now okay so that's done smoldering a little bit now I am going to well I don't have my box of salt so I take my I take my salt shaker and I will pour it around me to create a space of protection. Okay, now I'm going to put in a little tiny piece of dragon's blood. And again, please do not think that you have to use a whole bunch of everything. That is not how faith works. That is not how magic works. You see that? That's going to last like for the rest of the day. So I just put that on top of the charcoal. It's melting already. Oh, it smells so good. I got my Big Mama crystal, one of them. This one I got from Linda. Thank you, Linda. Last October. Not yesterday, October, the one before. Okay, you see that smoldering nicely? Now, what I'm going to do is recite my St. Patrick's prayer. I bind unto myself the power of God to hold and to lead, his eye to watch, his might to stay, his ear to hearken, to heed, hearken to my need, excuse me, the wisdom of God to teach his hand to guide, his shield to ward, the ward of God to give me speech, his heavenly host to be my guard, Christ be with me, Christ within me, Christ behind me, before me, within me, comfort and restore me, beneath me, above me, Christ in the hearts of all that love me, Christ in the mouth of every friend and stranger. I bind unto myself the name, the strong name of the Trinity, 
and in this case I mean the trinity of my Haitian um, witch, witchy sisters that have been coming to me some of you know about that in the form of dreams and my third eye so I'm not just talking about uh, mother father uh, father son holy ghost okay the strong name of the trinities by invocation of the same the three in one the one in three of whom all nature hath creation hath creation eternal father spirit word praise to the lord of my salvation salvation is of the christ the lord amen hail glorious saint patrick we honor thy name though aaron may claim thee the world knows thy fame the faith of our fathers is our treasure too how holy thought they that they learned it from you through crosses and trials its fire bum burned bright they show us the way the truth and the light great saint and intercede that which makes intercede that we always may be devoted and loyal true children of thee our love and devotion ever be ever like thine our thought of jesus our heart is his shrine our heart be his shrine excuse me and when to the end of life path we trod be near the great great bishop anointed of god and you can find that online it's called saint patrick's breastplate and hail glorious saint patrick Okay, so I quickly welcome the Guardians, East, South, West, and North, and I normally, like when the camera's off, I will do that individually. It's, it takes some time, so I will do that off camera, and I write my ritual to each generally you have one prayer or anointing or however you want to call it for each of the guardians okay and you have to learn to think of your own i was trying to quickly find mine in my book of shadows but see this happened so quickly this morning and you know when somebody says hey I'm really literally right on it I collect my things and now that I can go outside I go outside to do my thing and you know just get it done now not an hour from now not 30 minutes from now but right now why am I sitting around you know waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting that's not nice when you want your prayer you want it answered now right so we start with the east and I say something that I have written for myself for air and you like something that represents air like the incense that's already in there you can't see it <coughs> uh, that wish um, so this was well no I won't even say that part sorry so let me see if I have something um, no, I don't have anything that I want to say out loud. So for yourself, so let's see if I could just make up something off the top of my head. So I would have my incense. It represents air. And I would face the east and I would say, hail, east, air. I like this incense as an offering to you to blow through my mind ideas of wisdom and health so that I may help others prosper. Then you turn to the south, fire, and I would light my candle, and I would probably say the same thing, Pro maybe not, and then I'd turn to the west for water, and you might, you know, it's, it's, it's all intention, so you pour your little vase of water, or you have your real water. Normally, I would have that all set up. Next video, I'll have that all set up for you newbies that are newer than myself, for those of you that have been a witch longer than three years, yeah, you can feel free to give some ideas, but don't shit on me. And then I turn to the north, earth, okay? And I would have, you know, something representing earth, like a rock or dirt or 
a, tr a tree, a leaf or something. And I would say the same thing. Thank you for hail earth. Thank you for being here. I offer you a gift of blah, 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 blah. Hail and welcome earth. Okay, so I hail and welcome east, south, west, north. And give them a blessing. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to the rest of my ritual. Since I have, I told you I already did like half of it. So... I can keep it pushing and move on to the next and the next and the next. Dang it, I have to get me a little something to keep my <coughs> drawer open. See, and the birds are here listening and everybody's here listening. So now I am going to put on... Hello there, little bird. Thank you for being here with us. And I'm saying my ritual in my head. And I am picking out the herbs. Oh, I left that in the house. Dang it. Um, that are going to spur the grandmother into opening her heart and moving her behind right now. So, yeah, you know I got some cayenne pepper up in here. We could give her... No, I'm not going to give her that. I am going to give her... Mater, you want to hop up here and say hello to everybody? Some, ooh, yeah, wormwood, yes. And for those of you that are on my uh, Facebook page, this is what I was asking um, Shay about yesterday. She'll have it in her store in January. You buy this little tiny packet. For a dollar I don't know how much your prices might go up so don't hold me to it and then I looked up the witchy properties of all the herbs so right now I'm going to throw in a little wormwood and I'll throw in a lot of rose petals because I want I want to fill her with such love that she moves Quickly, okay. Them roses don't smell good burning, just so you know. And I'm going to anoint myself with my magical little potion that I had made for myself years ago and see boys and girls I'm telling you all these things I had in this hang on in my little witchy box Ugh, of stuff it's heavy sorry oh you can't see good this is where I keep all my smaller packages of herbs and stuff that I use for every ritual so now I'm going to take my ritual oil which is make everything look so pretty and I am going to anoint myself and bless myself along with this situation okay mmm that's starting to smell really good really 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 good okay and give her some of this and again you can't you can't say everything all the time so just know that I'm not doing it to mean any harm or to help you not learn but sometimes you just you have to learn yourself that's why I haven't you ever noticed in all those movies and stuff you never see no labels on nothing in no witchy shop or cave or ca tavern or 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 you never see no names and stuff written on stuff she she just knows where everything is and what everything looks like you know you don't have to be writing 
names and stuff okay so all this time that i'm adding this i am sending out my intent i am seeing since i have pictures of them i am seeing them holding hands walking through the door oh and she's opening her christmas presents oh where's my little um i wanted to burn one of these since in the house dang it Hey, where did I put the, um, I know they're in here, hang on, my little orbs, my little sticky orbs, oh, here they are, I love these, and you see, I got these years ago, years, like two years ago, see that Shay, Dragon's Blood Incense Orbs, and I love burning, they're real chewy, well, <laughs> squishy okay so I'm gonna envision 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 and you see you just take a little piece off okay just a little piece you don't need the whole thing see that you don't need the whole thing okay and we're just gonna put that on there oh bless you little one and it smells so good There we go. I knew it was still hot underneath there. And that's, um, oh, it smells so good. I wish you guys were here. And then from Sage, Eversage, Eversage. That's the name of her new store on Etsy. E-V-E-R-S-A-G-E, -E, all one word. Um, Earth Baby Elements used to be her name, okay? And this is divination fire throw which i put a little bit of in every ritual okay and now again what am i going to say you know what i'm going to say just a pinch just a little dab will do ya okay there you go now sometimes i will blend this all up first and sometimes i won't like in this case each and every case is different there's nothing the same that works the same that works the same that works the same so let's not even think that. My cowrie shells from the farmer. Calling on all the Orishas, angels, saints, cherubs, everyone that is available to assist me in this matter. Oh yes, and don't forget the, the cayenne pepper so we can move now. She can move now. She can move now. She moves now. They're already here. Happy. Content. Bliss filled. And even to boost this, I'm going to go in and make a sigil. Okay. I'm going to make a sigil to put with our St. Patrick's grid. Dragon's blood orbs. 
so good. Okay, so now I sit here and I do my prayers and whatnot. That's, you know, personal. And just fill everyone with love and peace and harmony. Everything is in divine order with the universe, galaxies, spirits. So that we all can work together on behalf of the same purpose. Now don't forget, like I said, just because I did this this time, it's different next time, and next time, and next time, and next time. So, but the imp most important thing, yes, that is my book of shadows. I got that from Shay also. Is that you do it, that you get your energy out there, however you do it. It's not wrong. So, I know uh, as a newbie, I don't think of, I was afraid of doing things wrong. I just didn't know back then what is a representation of air, earth, water, fire, you know? And so many things are, thanks to Ryan teaching me that, you know? So, I want you just to visualize a little seven-year-old girl holding her mommy's hand. They're opening their gifts. Everyone is happy and eating and music and frolicking and just being at peace. Just being at peace with each other. And these beautiful um, eagle eggs. <laughs> that beautiful. Remember I made a pendant out of one huge chunk. So beautiful. Look at Marcy's got all this beautiful eagle egg. Eagle eggs? Yeah. Can you see it? That gorgeous. So today I wish them and I wish you love, peace, harmony, and more joy than your heart or hands can hold. This is Lady Narcissa a.k.a. Tasha'sTouch.com, a.k.a. TheAngels.us, wishing you all the highest and the best vibration in every area of your life. I love you and I wish you well.